Hello everybody, my name is Lil Joe Studios and welcome to another KSP video. Now this is the first KSP video that I've ever done voiceover for. I mean, of course, it's uh, not normal for me, but I'm trying new things. After all, the channel just recently hit 50 subscribers. I mean, that's fun. But anyways, the rocket is taking off this, with a surprise and that nice silver cone and the boosters <laughs> collided into each other as they have just now separated. Now it is just that mammoth blasting us all the way to space. Now I did put quite a lot of fuel into this. I was hoping to, uh, you know, not need to circularize my orbit with that main stage, but it turns out, well, I guess that's just what happened. So now there's debris in space. Bummer. But, you know, we're going to space. Yeah. Anyways, we're the, we have now gotten ourselves an apoapsis of about 80 kilometers. I can't see it with this tiny preview, but suspecting that the engine has stopped, that's what I'm guessing is happening. Now we are just coasting our way up into out of the atmosphere so I can make a maneuver node without worrying about the atmosphere decaying the orbit. Now we are making the maneuver node to circularize. By the way, just mentioning, you probably have already seen this, but this rocket is piloted by our brave Kerbal 50 Kerman. Very, very creative, I know. But he is going to ride this rocket all the way to its destination. And, um, yeah. Just letting the rocket do its thing that rockets do. Circularizing now. Ooh, camera wobbly. Because the camera is always on auto when it starts, which is a bit annoying, but you gotta deal with what you got. And, um, I mean, with the recent updates, Kervin just looks that much more beautiful. But you only saw it for a second, so. Eh, my bad. Anyways. We are, uh, getting ready to take this thing to the moon. Yes, we are going to the moon for this mission. Yeah, I know, the moon might be a little bit of a strange place. Not not strange place, just a place that's pretty easy to go to. Not much special about it. It's gray and it's always in the sky. But, I mean, it's a cool place to go to nonetheless. I mean, besides... Don't know where I was going with that. Yeah, these things aren't scripted. They probably won't be scripted. Probably need to be scripted. But anyways, we are just getting ready to send this rocket to the moon. Approaching our maneuver node. And we're off towards the moon. Or moon. Why have I been pronouncing it moon? I always pronounce it moon, normally. But... We have, we're on the way, and it ran out of fuel before I could get it onto that collision course with the MUN. Bummer, again. But now we're sending from Kerbin all the way to the MUN, and Kerbin just looking beautiful as we proceed away from it. Just that cool, nice blue marble, and cool little cinematic shot here of the ship moving past. I do have camera tools, I just didn't use camera tools because I was lazy. And... Here we are, we, have, we are now in the Mun's SOI, or Sphere of Influence. And we are just setting a desirable periaps to get our apoaps down to the right angle. Because, right altitude, yeah. And... Yeah. We are now about to head down to the Mun and circularize right about now and we're now at the Mun it's looking gorgeous since it's revamp and gosh, I forgot what update but it was one of the more recent updates you know the one where scatterer broke uh, card top right I guess and now we're circularizing around the Mun with way too way too powerful rocket and there it is there's the surprise it doesn't look like much but the more you uh, click that subscribe, the larger this thing will expand. This is a station core, and uh, it is going to be the start of hopefully something pretty cool. As you can see, the 50 on that satellite probe 
and we are just doing some beauty shots, I guess. Just roaming around, yeah, looking nice, looking nice. 50 is up in that uh, cupola. And now we are going to deorbit this thing. We're not just going to deorbit it, no, no, no. That's just lame, although explosions are cool. But we are going to land this sucker on the moon. Mun. In hindsight, though, I don't really know why I did this. It could have just stayed in orbit and then get used again as something. Be fueled and used again. But, well, now it's on the surface of the moon. Now we're feeling it's gonna be a, a whole lot harder. But, I mean, should I even refuel it or should I just leave it there as a landmark? Comment your opinion. Or, I mean, do whatever you want, I don't care. <laughs> but, I mean, I mean, it's not that I don't care, it's just that I don't mind what you do. Anyways, we are coming in. Cr the bottom of craters are actually pretty flat. I mean, sure, it's, well, um, whoops. Okay, just reloading a quick save there. Blasted a bit too much and didn't want to wait pass out flats again. Plus, I like the landing spot that we were, that I had chosen. So that's where we're going now. And, yeah, we are d beginning our descent, just taking it nice and easy, nice and carefully. Yeah, just don't want to do anything too stupid. Because, well, I mean, you wouldn't want to... Depends, though. <laughs> do you want to explode or not? But here we are, touching down on the MUN. It- oh, texture broke. I don't know why textures are breaking this update, but we are now going up from the debris to- all, uh, we're going around the MUN all the way back to the station core. Yes, back to the station core. A little color melt there. And- oh, by the way, everyone. 50 is alone on the station core. All, his only friend is that, you know, golden probe core. So do help a Kerbal out and cut that red rectangle that's below the video that everybody keeps talking about. But anyways, coming up soon is the end of this video. I do hope you enjoyed. 50 has surely, has really enjoyed this uh, mission as you saw in the bottom right. So, you know, help a Kerbal out. He is lonely on the station core. And, um, yeah, hit that red rectangle below the video that everybody keeps talking about. Ring that bell that's right next to it, conveniently. And drop a like if you want. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm Lil Joe Studios. End cards kind of come up probably right about now. And, um, yeah, I'm Lil Joe Studios. This has been Kerbal Space Program. Have a good one.